Hey guys, Zuljin here and welcome back to another episode of Dragon Quest Builders. I hope y'all are doing wonderful today. We are about to get started with the uh, the stuff that we found last episode, which is like the Forma Sutra. Uh, in order to do that, I think we're going to need to craft a rake. So let's see, how can we craft a rake? Rake. There we go. All it takes is a broken branch. Everything you can craft from a broken branch. It's wonderful. We are like MacGyver. Uh, also, look at all of these. First of all, we have a quest uh, from Geronimo. But look. Must have super salad. So hungry for fries. <laughs> it looks like we're going to have to farm uh, to get the next recipes off. Remarkable, Zuljin. You found the Forma Sutra. Quickly now. Let me take a look. Huh. Huh. Aha. So that's how it's done. That's how our ancestors cultivated crops. Thalmus was a man of unparalleled learning, a sage of far renown. He compiled the collective knowledge of human civilization before it was lost to the ages, now preserved for future generations. According to his records, far in the southern reaches of Remolder lies a blessed land where the Holy Sanctum once stood. Sadly, the Sanctum itself was destroyed by the Dragon Lord's forces. Not a trace of it of the consecrated chancel remains. But on the side of its ruins, a great tree now stands that holds within it the power of life itself. The World Tree, Yadrasil. Thalmus records say no, Thalmus's records say no more on the subject, but this may be all we need to guide us. If we continue our research, we may yet drive the blight from this land. In the meantime, Zuljin, I suggest you try your hand at agriculture arts that Thalmus has bequeathed to us. I intend to, and thank you for the five Chimera Wings. Alright, let's talk again. I don't mean to rush you, Zuljin, but I urge you to begin your farming efforts at the earliest opportunity. From what I read in the Pharma Sutra, you should be able to use the Herbalist Cauldron to retrieve seeds from the plants you find in the wilds. You need to use the rake to till the soil and make it fit to plant those seeds. I've come up with an idea for the garden we can use to grow wheat and other vegetables. I've drawn up a blueprint <laughs> for you. I call it the veggie patch. Get the blueprint built, young man. We can grow all the food we need from nothing but sprouts and seeds. All right. I can't believe, man. <laughs> use a rake while standing over the earth block to make it perfect growing for plants. Put seeds in the tilled soil to watch your garden grow. All right, so let's see how this is going to go. Um, I moved the trees, by the way. I took down the trees and I put the two uh, saplings that I had from there. And let's see, how big is this going to be? It's actually not that bad. Guessing right here? I might just do it right here. There we go. All right, now what do we need? Um, it looks like we need a bunch of the uh, the fencing. Uh, 18 to be exact. Wheat, potatoes, wooden steps, butter beans. Okay, I got you. So it needs earth? Yeah, it all needs to be on top of earth, which is gonna be weird. How about this? I want it at floor level, so I think I'm going to remove blueprint. Wait, yeah, I do want it at floor level. I know what I'm doing. I swear. Monsters appear near my base, huh? Well, I need to take care of this. Where are they? I uh, don't see him. Oh, are they there? No. I don't see where the monsters are. Maybe they already handled them. I have no idea. Oh, here we go. No, I'm not trying to... I shoveled them. How odd. Okay. I think it's this big, y'all. Okay, let's see how this works. Uh, 
we're gonna have to do this. There we go. We're also gonna sleep too because this is gonna get ridiculous really quick. Really quickly. Ah, perfect timing. Perfect timing. All right. Every time you sleep, it looks like your trees glow, grow. So that's pretty good. All right, so. There's gonna be stairs right there. <laughs> I know it wanted the, they wanted me to make it higher, but I wanted it I wanted it floor level, so are not it oh that has to be tealed I see I think hold on okay that's regular all that needs to be tilled, I'm guessing. Maybe I should have did it on the raised platform so I could know what I'm doing right. All right, I'll tell you what. Let's just clear this out. All right. So. The outside perimeter for sure is all dirt except for the two center pieces. And I think the rest is gonna, it's 20 altogether. So, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, yeah, I see now. So it's just the outside. The rest is gonna be that teal dirt, which I'm gonna have to make with the rake, I guess. But I'm just gonna get the stuff, the outer edge done right now. Also gonna need wooden steps. Gotta be difficult, huh, Z? All right, what, do I still have any wooden steps here? I have stone steps. I don't think I have any wooden steps. Hold on, I know what I could do. It'll look snazzy this way too. <laughs> ah, cheated. go all right now I'm gonna need some fence let's do I always forget where my own stuff is all right fencing 18 I think we're gonna need one more set I need more broken branches let me go get some out here really quick all I need is five broken branches There's three, and this should be it right here. I'm gonna get some extra since I'm out here already. That's good. Alrighty. Oh, I was supposed to do fence all right that'll give me the 18 that I need as far as all the plants go I'm gonna have to go looking for those so what else is there all right uh, all around on the top I'm gonna need fence 
So... I don't think it stacks, does it? No, good. Alright, now what? Now all we need is tilled soil in the middle, and that's going to be 3 by 5 So... Oh, I guess this is it then. And well, does it show that it's tilled? It does. a little bit more defined okay now all I'm gonna need is the plants so for the plants I need what here I need butter beans I need wheat and potatoes I don't know where I'm gonna get potato plants I haven't found any potato plants that I know of yet um, but we're gonna go looking around I do suppose um, as far as Using the shovel for the butter beans and wheat, I'm going to have to go to the red area. So let's go ahead and do that. Oh, also before I, I head out of here, let me put some of this stuff up. There we go. That should be good. Alright, wheat, butter beans. I'm just going to start shoveling stuff. And it should be relatively easy to get to. I need to get up there. Ah. There we go. Okay, oh, I do want some of these too. Definitely want to grow some of these. Hopefully I can make seeds with these. If I can't, I'll be able to plant them and harvest them anyway, so no biggie. Alright, where is the... But I can't believe it's turning night already. I just got here. I just got here, man. Hold on. some wheat. Good. What was that butter beans? I'm not sure which one it was. Wheat. Yeah, it was wheat. Good. Good, good, good. That is cotton, I want to say. Where was the butter beans at? I don't remember. The dang ghosts are gonna come out and they're gonna make me crazy. I forgot how much wheat it said I needed, but... So far so good with the ghosts. Not much. Get the wheat. Alright, that should be enough wheat plants there. As far as the butter beans go, they might actually be in the first area. 
and potatoes, I have no idea. We might have to explore further. Yeah, let's go. Yep. Let's get out of here. Alright. Potato plants, I'm not too sure about. Butter beans, we can go and get from here. Let's go to sleep really quick. Yeah, there's a spot open for me. Somebody was smart and made more beds. <laughs> can you imagine if I made houses for all these people? Good lord. Alright. Perfect. Everybody up, oh, rise and shine. They all stretched at the same time. That's cool. Alright, let's go out. And I'm pretty sure there was butter beans out in those hills over there. So, that's what we'll get. Yep, right there. That's what I was looking for, y'all. Can I not? Oh. Maybe I shoveled some before. Maybe it's just regular old butter beans. You don't have to have this shovel for them. Well, if that's the case, I really am lost on the potato deal, man. <laughs> Hold on, we just need a few more butter beans. I don't think we needed much. But I cooked almost everything I had, so I am going to grab a few more. Alright, and that right there is five. Any more sprouts around? Yeah, there's some right here. I'll just grab these sprouts and then I'll call it. There we go. Okay, and we're gonna cheat and get a chimera wing too. Okay. So I have a feeling that we're gonna need to go deep into that place that we were before. Okay, let's take a look at the cauldron. Build. Okay, so we can make butterbean sprouts. How many do we need? It takes three. Oh, good. Let's go ahead and do six. I know we won't need more than that. Potato. We definitely need potatoes. That's what we need for that. And wheat seeds. Alright. So... Put these grass seeds up. Grab the wheat seeds. Okay, so. I'm gonna put these up too. Cotton plants, butter beans, grass. Where did I put the wheat seeds? Oh, they're at the front. That's why. Alright, no problem. So let's see. It looks like. I have no idea with the wheat. It doesn't say which one is which. Okay, so wheat is five, potato is three. It looks like wheat is gonna be on this side and it's gonna surround it. So, right here, yeah. Beautiful, okay, now butter beans. Butter bean. Didn't we? Where? Oh, there they are. They went in too. Okay, and these go same thing around the sides, and potatoes are gonna go in the middle. So we need three potatoes right here. That's all we're gonna need for our little garden. It's beautiful. All right. Let's <laughs> let's let's go to the red area here and go back to where we were. Back to where we were and we're going to be looking for plants that we have not found before. That's what we're looking for. Also, I don't think I grabbed any of these with my shovel yet, so I'm going to try. Yep, first begonia. I'm going to grab a few. 
I don't know if we'll need them, but I'll grab them. Maybe, if anything else, for the greenery. <laughs> Alright. And you never know. Never know what you'll need. I don't think I need any of those either. These, um, like, lily pad things? Nope. Can't get those with a shovel. That's fine. Everything wants to kill me. Alright, where was that dang castle at now? You know, I didn't try to fish in these waters. It does seem like a kind of precarious place to fish. But guys, you never really know, do you? You never really know. Come on. Splash. There it is. Get away. I pressed when I was supposed to press. Orange oil. Is it going to be one of those things again where I'm just fishing up boots and stuff the whole time? I pressed it. Maybe it's because it's a very challenging catch. Or maybe you just get orange oil over and over and over again right here. Okay. Wow. Um, this is interesting. All right. Let's throw some rocks at it, you guys. Oh, it's after me. It only does... I only did three damage to it. Eek! 18. Alright, this thing is hardcore. Um... No, that's not what I want. I did not hurt. Oh my god, look at the stuff coming after me, y'all. Ouch. <laughs> Almost got him. What? Crown ghouls? I have no idea what that's for. I have no clue. But, <laughs> that is definitely awesome. Let me try to fish again here. How that big old slime came out of the little bit of water? I should have known with all the... the um. The slime that I was pulling out of this water, and you know, oh snap, guys, guys, y'all are not gonna believe this. It looks like a slime. <laughs> That's genius. That is so good. <laughs> all right. All right, all right, all right. Is it in the equipment bag? No, I don't know what that helmet's for. That was very cool, though. All right, let's get to the... <laughs> let's get to that castle. Where was I even going? I even forgot how to get there. All right. Let's put up the, um, the bird's eye view again. Which way do I go? I didn't have my old quest marker, so I think it's over there. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it's over there. It's not towards the red. Yeah, there it is. There it is. There it is. Okay. Good. Alright. Um, did I get these yet? Okay. They just give hard fruits. They don't give anything special. Oh! <gasps> Dang it, I always do that right there. Alright, I need to quickly get to sleep here. 
quickly, quickly, quickly before it gets ugly. No! Oh, it let me sleep, thankfully. Sometimes when it senses a monster around you, it doesn't let you sleep. Alright. Okay, new plants. That's what we're looking for here, ladies and gentlemen. New plants. We're just going to kind of dodge most of the things around here while we look. And every once in a while, if we get into a fight, we get into a fight. You know, Are these potatoes? Alright. They look like just regular... Oh, yes! Perfect potato! Ah, potato salad! Super salad! That's awesome. Alright, I think you can actually get these without using the shovel on them. But it doesn't hurt. Okay, I'm very glad we got these potato plants. I want more, though. Everything's gonna come after me. Everything is out right now. Everything. All right. I didn't forget about my stuff that I gotta go back for it too. Yeah, you can just get it without the shovel. And what the heck is the shovel for? I know it's for stuff that I. I, I know what you're saying, guys. I know. Uh, while I'm out here, I'm just gonna do a little bit of exploring really quickly. Doesn't look like there's anything. <gasps> what is that? What is that? Examine. No reply, just a pile of scrap metal. But there's something in its hand. Sultan obtains a tribute to a missing maker blueprint. What? tribute to Missing Maker, a garden of remembrance where mourners might pay their respects in peace. Aha! I wonder if you can build this thing anywhere, or if it has to be like in town or whatever. I think you should be able to build it anywhere. First, I'm going to have to kill this thing. Again. Okay. Not enough space right here. Okay, this is really upsetting. Not enough space. So, I'm thinking that it can't be right here. Unless... Yeah, it, can, it won't be able to be right here. I guess I'm going to have to do it inside. Or maybe I could just build it out here. Yeah, it lets me put it down. Alright, let's eat a few of these cooked crab claws. What did this take? Hardly anything, to tell you the truth. Okay. Uh, let's just do it right quick. Might have to harvest a few sticks or whatever. And what you got, baby? Mm -hmm. All right. My wife was just telling me bye. Alright, um, so let's see what we need here. We need... Okay, I already got three of those gravestones. There's a fire, there's... What kind? Oh no, I need a saloon door. Okay, a bench, milk blossoms. I am gonna have to go to the house to do this. So we're gonna finish this up 
the next episode you guys because i need to get that bench and stuff so i hope you guys enjoyed this one if you did give me some dap on that like button to show you support and you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos thanks so much for watching as, as always this is ojin signing off and we'll see you next time